As you travel along State Road A1A in Flagler and Volusia counties, you can now observe all phases of construction on the two buried seawalls being built by the FDOT, which will protect this vulnerable section of the scenic highway. Beginning at the northern end in Flagler County, final touches are being applied as the contractor installs landscaping and reconstructs beach walkovers. FDOT collaborated closely with community partners and the contractor to accelerate walkover reconstruction and restore full access to the beach. Moving south into the Volusia County section of the northern wall, the contractor has covered the completed wall and is shaping the dune in preparation for landscaping. The department is installing a significant number of native plants to help protect the dunes. In this section, workers are preparing the concrete cap, the final step in constructing the wall. The cap secures the individual piles, resulting in a more substantial and stronger wall. Work on the 1.3 mile northern wall is expected to be completed later this summer. The final beach walkovers are scheduled to be finished in late April. Construction on the southern wall in Volusia County began in September and is moving quickly. The contractor has been working closely with community partners and residents to coordinate access to the beach and expedite construction in preparation for hurricane season. The contractor has now completed the installation of over 6,898 linear feet of piles, representing 51% of the total wall, and is preparing this section for cap construction. The secant wall structure is comprised of auger cast piles or concrete columns that interlock to provide strength and stability. On the southern wall, the contractor is installing piles and using this specially designed rig. To prepare for the drill, workers construct a temporary guide wall and a work platform. The contractor transports sand from a local FDEP-approved sand pit to create the platform on the southern wall. As we enter the summer months, the construction team will continue to monitor the work zone for wildlife diligently. The department collaborates closely with the local sea turtle permit holder to ensure the protection of turtles and other wildlife in the area. The wall construction is expected to be completed later this summer, with the entire project scheduled for completion in early 2026. As we move forward, FDOT urges everyone to remain safe and exercise caution when traveling through work zones.